I'd like to tell you about the cover story for the September issue of Physics World, which is about a hypothetical particle that could potentially solve three of the biggest mysteries in physics. Now, to help me demonstrate these mysteries, I've brought along a selection of sweets. So, uh, the first mystery is to do with a type of particle called the neutrino, and neutrinos come in three flavours. But the mystery is, why do neutrinos have a small but significant mass when the standard model of particle physics says that they should have no mass at all? The second mystery um, is, what is dark matter? So, dark matter makes up four-fifths of all the matter in the universe, and only a fifth of it is, is the visible matter that we can see. For mystery number three, we go back to um, shortly after the Big Bang, when it's thought that there were equal amounts of matter and antimatter in the universe. So I'm representing antimatter by these white chocolate buttons and matter with these milk chocolate buttons. So antimatter and matter, when they, when they come together, they annihilate each other. So pretty soon after the Big Bang, a lot of this matter and antimatter disappeared. But what it left behind was an excess of matter. And the question is, why did that happen? So the hypothetical particle that could potentially solve all three of these mysteries is, it's another neutrino. It would be quite different to the three neutrinos we already know about. And a main difference would be that it hardly interacts at all via the weak force, which is one of the four fundamental forces in the universe. And that's why this is known as the sterile neutrino. So to find out more about this story, check out the September issue of Physics World and the cover story by science writer John Cartwright called A Fourth Type of Neutrino. <laughs>